Like last night we were out with the students on a Euro tour and like five girls approached us. And one of them was this cute little blonde girl and she was like literally approaching every single Asian guy. She was looking for a Filipino, right? But like, it was the first time like there was a girl that had like an Asian fetish. Hey guys, it's JT Tran from the ABCs of Attraction, the number one Asian dating coach. And today, I am not only having a special guest, which I always do, but I am in a special location. I'm all the way in Europe, or more specifically, Warsaw, Poland. And let me tell you, it's amazing. I am loving it here already. Like last night we were out with the students on a Euro tour and like five girls approached us. And one of them was this cute little blonde girl and she was like literally approaching every single Asian guy. She was looking for a Filipino, right? But like it's the first time like there was a girl that had like an Asian fetish. But you know what? That's because we're Asian, we're maybe exotic. Here I brought in Mac from Flirt Academy here in Poland. So Mac, tell our audience a little bit about yourself and also reveal the secrets as you are the expert guy here in Poland. How can our audience like pick up and meet Polish girls themselves? All right, so uh, it all began in 2005 after 2006 with broken hearts, of mm. course. Yeah. And then I was really desperate and I tried to look up some stuff on the internet how to pick up girls and of course i've stumbled upon it in poland there was nothing actually going on there uh, in terms of pickup and all that stuff so I it was a relatively new scene yeah. yeah well it was starting in us also but you know mm -hmm. in poland it was like non-existent almost so uh, i started to work on it and uh, i think i found my own way and my own style uh, which uh, I really like and I feel congruent with it. Mm -hmm. That's very important, obviously. Yeah. Uh, and so as you're exploring like your style and you're going out there, you're doing like day game, night game? Well, actually, uh, both things. Both? Um, day game, night game. I really like to build uh, some connections. For example, uh, I have several shops which I visit on a regular occasion. So I always chat with the girls and we become, well, maybe not friends, but acquaintance, acquaintances. Acqu yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we become that and uh, then um, it's, it's actually a very easy game. I like bartenders, I like, of course, not strippers, dancers. Not dancers, dancers, yes, yes. And, uh, and regular girls as well, you know. Okay, and so you're meeting these girls, and what have you learned about Polish girls? Like, how do Polish girls like a guy to approach them, talk to them, seduce them? Because there is, at least as Americans and Asian Americans at that, there does seem to be a, a difference between American girls and Polish girls. So sure. what do you recommend, like, how, how to pick up a Polish girl? Uh, in comparison to American girls, I think that there are a few things that you should consider. First, uh, you can't be that blunt as with American girls. Uh, probably don't say, hey, let's go to my place and, you know, have some fun time. <laughs> that would be too obvious. But yeah, so be subtle. Yeah, well, let's, um, well, if you want, we can grab a wine, we're gonna drink it and I'm gonna put you in a cab. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not more than one or two hours, maybe. Yeah, I don't have too much time because tomorrow I have to wake up early or something like that. Uh, because um, po Poland is a pretty Catholic country. Actually, many people don't follow it, obviously, this strongly. <laughs> but there is still, you know, like cultural thing, you know, mm -hmm. that it's still rooted that uh, girls don't want to be sluts. And, uh, well, well, we could argue that. <laughs> <laughs> they don't want to be seen, yes, right? Yes, yeah. they want to be seduced. Of course, they like to seduce and to pick up. But in Poland, we also, uh, because it's a Catholic country, it's this tradition that um, those the guys are the active side of the relationship, that the men should pick up women, not the other way around. So... In Poland, you're saying like the, the girls definitely expect you to approach, to be the, the first one to take that step. Yeah, they uh, don't walk up very often. Mm -hmm. Maybe when they are looking for some sponsor or something like that. <laughs> For Asian guys, <laughs> but, yeah, but it's uh, it's it's of course uh, every situation is different. But uh, 
um, basically uh, she will give you some signals maybe a look maybe a smile maybe she's gonna dance near you or walk to the bar stand near you and she's gonna create uh, an opportunity for you so you should use it uh, in my opinion and start with something subtle um, probably indirect would be the best so you um, when it comes to your approach you, your recommendation is that your indirect is better well in my opinion on day game the day direct game. is okay. better actually okay on the night game the indirect is a little bit better okay uh, polish women like uh, to flirt they like mm -hmm. to seduce it's uh, uh, it's something natural to them and they like to the play. Uh, not necessarily the, 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 the final act is, is, is the central point of the whole experience, but the whole road that, you know, how you treat her. Of course, uh, I think that you should be a little bit gentlemanly because, as I said, it's a little bit tradition, more focused country. Um, but, of course, don't be like, um, you know, too sweet okay so well, don't don't sense. be that, that that nice guy yeah right? don't be the nice okay. guy uh but don't be uh, an asshole of course <laughs> gotcha <laughs> gotcha it's always about finding that right kind of like medium where you have to be yeah. dominant enough but also a gentleman you have to be like nice but not a doormat right so is that yes of bit? course okay uh, well i think that there's uh, this one i all, all often say that there's one rule um, in Polish it would be SSK, uh, but it uh, essentially means uh, respect yourself and then fuck. <laughs> so respect yourself, fuck, for fuck's sake, it should mm -hmm. be, right? Um, and um, I think it's the essential thing uh, at all in the whole pickup. You can be active, you can be, you can show what you want, you can uh, show um, who you are, show your own, own whole personality, um, you can try a little bit, but don't, don't, don't let her disrespect you, just respect yourself, you know, it's, uh, it's, I often ask myself a question, what would a girl do? Would she run after a guy? No, she wouldn't. Would she apologize for something that she didn't didn't do or which wasn't wrong at all? No, she wouldn't. So I think that uh, that you should ask yourself this question: uh, how not to be too much apologizing and you know too soft. I think that the key thing is to like uh, feel the control. This is my world. This is my emotions. People can do whatever they want. They are different people. They are cool people. They are some bastards and all that stuff. But you know, this is your world. You're gonna. You're deciding who you're gonna let in. Who you're not gonna let in. Who you want to talk with. And uh, I think it's 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 uh, it's the cornerstone. Yeah. One thing I, I notice here in Europe in, in Polish girls is that they're more more feminine, if you will. Yes. And so they expect their men to be men and. You know, when you're too polite, especially in Asian culture, like we're very mm -hmm. polite, but if you're too polite, like they kind of consider a sign of weakness or like, you know, not being manly enough. So what I found is like being firm, leading, being dominant is very important. But another thing I also noticed is, you know, Polish, you know, the younger generation, mm -hmm. they do speak English, but not the greatest English, but, you know, make an effort. You know, I have like the, the Google Translate like, to check. Um, is that the the teasing is less here and it's like more about comfort game it seems yeah um as we said it's a little bit subtle because um uh, because uh, no, well women try not to be perceived as sluts they're really afraid of it mm -hmm. he's gonna think that i'm easy or something like that so um yeah i think that a little bit more more uh, comfort and a little bit more chat and when you're building sexuality don't do it in an obvious way just a look sometimes a yeah. look can be eye contact <laughs> smile a little bit of touch very subtle with a finger somewhere over here it can be quite enough to show that you're interested in her and uh, i think that many guys uh, make the mistake of 
uh, being too sexual, like almost predatory, right? Mm. And not subtle, like, hey, you're cute. And, and that's all. Without any expectation, uh, without any pushing. Um, well, actually, uh, if uh, she's hit there and she's talking with you, she's smiling and it's a nice conversation, she's kind of interested. Of course, uh, maybe not the way you would like, but it's a good start. So keep doing it and um, keep escalating. Quite often, if you ask her if she wants to kiss, if, if she wants to uh, go to your place, she will feel like, oh no, it's, well, it shouldn't be spoken. It should just happen. So uh, I think it's, um, it's very important to do it discreetly. For example, I wouldn't kiss a girl, kiss a girl on the dance floor. Of course, you can do it, but it's not the best effective thing. Uh, rather, I would isolate her from the club, go somewhere outside, so her friends wouldn't see. Yeah, very important. Yeah, cool, cool. Especially in Poland. Yeah, because <laughs> everybody's checking up on everybody. All right. Yeah. This has been some really great advice on how to meet um, and pick up uh, Polish Thanks. girls. So, Mac. How can our audience find more about you? Okay, uh, um, actually, uh, my full name is Mati Moros, but probably it's something that you won't be able to spell. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, my website is akademiafrir2.pl. So if somebody knows Polish, he can type it right in. If you don't know the po Polish, you can just jump. The website. Yeah, we'll put it. Yeah. yeah, we'll put it in the link in somewhere over here. So check it out, guys, and we will see you at the next Your Tour. It's been amazing, and let me tell you that. Okay, this is amazing for Asia. I am loving it. I don't want to even leave. But Mac, thanks so much, man. I appreciate thanks it very much. Thanks for watching our video. I hope you liked it, and make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and watch all our other videos. Great news too. Every Monday, we'll be putting out a new weekly video. That's right, we've got educational seminars, street interviews, uh, fun infield pickup videos, and anything else we can come up with that's fun for you guys to watch. So check back.